Parker Hannifin is a $10 billion organization, the world leader in motion control technology. The Aerospace Group, one of eight operating groups of Parker Hannifin, is obviously focused on systems for aerospace. In that work, we design flight control, hydraulic systems, fuel management systems for aircraft built around the world. To do that design work effectively, we need to analyze the products that we produce and make sure without necessarily building physical prototypes that we can verify the functionality of the products we produce. When talking to Intel about their multi-core processors several months ago, we decided that we wanted to find a way to leverage that technology on the desktop so that individual engineers, instead of waiting for days or hours for a job to run on a server farm, could run that same job on their desktop. In order to make that happen, we needed some hardware from HP that had multiple processor ports in it with several cores in each. Frankly, more memory than any engineer would usually have on their workstation. And then the products from Parallels to be able to separate the front end that the engineer would use on a daily basis to do their CAD work or email or Internet Explorer work and the functionality on the back end running that hike performance or compute intensive solving application without impacting the engineer's daily normal workload. The final solution we came up with was what I termed a micro cloud involving Intel multi-core processors plugged into the HP Z800 workstation that also includes multiple NIC cards and the parallels technology to be able to provide the front end technology to the end user as well as the solving technology in a micro cloud or cluster on the same physical workstation to achieve more designs, better designs in the same amount of time. Overall, engineering managers and information technology managers need to provide a return on investment when they acquire technology by utilizing the Intel multi-core processors, the HP workstations, and the Parallels technology to control the memory and the processors, we're able to deliver more computing horsepower for a lower cost and achieve better results in the same period of time.